So now we need to go back the way that we came after deviating from our quest long enough. Next time! <laughs> so yay! I love this little world. Golly! Super Mario 64. And it's really funny because Lake Hylia and Zora's Domain are really so far from each other. They really are on the on the Hyrule map. And uh, we actually, that is the first time we've been to Lake Hylia. But I wonder what's in that, uh, in that bottle. Maybe I should read it. Read at your own risk. Hmm. Might be spray. Let's see. It could be. Cover the kids' eyes in case it's something they don't need to see. What does it say here? Huh? Look it looks like, like there is something already inside this bottle. It's a letter. Help me, I'm waiting for you inside Lord Jobby Jobby's belly. Rudo. P.S. Don't tell my father. What the heck? What kind of shenanigans is this? Some strange fetishes. Did I talk to you first? Oh golly, why am I looking at your book? <laughs> we are good at diving. How about you? If you want to be a master diver, try the diving game at the top of the waterfall. Have you tried it already? Um, yes, I have. Oh, they're just co competent for you, so they're fine. <laughs> Felicia's just no fun. That's <laughs> because she hasn't LP with you in a while. Alright, well, let's talk to this poor dude up here. Did you say whore, dude? <laughs> yep. <laughs> poor dude. I heard whore. Come on now, let's get serious. I mean, this LP's already going down the drain. I mean, well, I, we all did warn everybody, like, at the first part, that, you know, it was going to be insane. We warned yep. them. We warned them, fair and square. And I even said uh, they weren't ready for the three of us. <laughs> no, I really, I don't think I'm ready for the three of us. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> this is, this has been something else. All right, dude. How about this thing? Um, don't call me that, please. <laughs> oh! This letter is from Princess Ruto. Yep, it is. Unless somebody uh, is trying to impersonate her. Hmm, let's see. She's inside Lord Jabu Jabu. That's not possible. Get in my belly! Golly, how could she even be alive if she's inside him? That's kind of weird. Well, you're Strange Biden finishes. Our guardian god, Lord Jabba Jabba, would never eat my dear Princess Ruto. Well, I don't know. He might. Ooh. But since that stranger, Ganondorf, came here, Lord Jabba Jabba has been a little green around the gills. Oh, uh, really? Old Dustina at it again. Everywhere she goes. The evidence seems clear. Of course, you'll go find Ruto. You can pass through here. The altar of Lord Jabba Jabba. <laughs> I love this voice. I'll keep this letter. You keep the bottle it was in. Take it respectfully. <laughs> Take it good, lick it. <laughs> Please find my dear Princess Ruto immediately. Sora. Um. Oh my gosh, and now we're going to have to wait like 10 years for you to get over. This is just an awesome you, you yeah. really need, Dude, you really need to not skip leg day. I mean, you really should. I mean, this is a very awkward deal. But I don't know, it looks like he skips every day, not just leg day. Just like my brother Mac from Jack 2. <laughs> <laughs> oh golly, oh Mac, man. Golly, we learned a lot about Mac in our last session. Oh my god, they do look a lot alike. They really do with the big body and the uh, very legs. small legs. Golly. Of course, anybody that knows Jack too would probably have no idea what the heck we're talking about unless they've watched Mail B. <laughs> but, uh, but, hmm. I wonder what we should do. Let's go on in here. Since he moved out of the way so kindly. I think if he would ever stand up and get a blood clot, he'd die. No. Uh, Zorus Fountain. Ooh. That must be Lord Jabu Jabu. Oh, and guess what? We're gonna get to see our new fairy soon. Oh joy. This is my fairy this fairy is mine. This one's mine. Yeah, this mm -hmm. was Joseph's here. Yep. Zorus Fountain. Don't disturb Lord Jabu Jabu. King Zora the sixteenth. 
I know my Roman numerals. <laughs> you should. You're a math <laughs> teacher. <laughs> I'm sure that's why you hesitated. Yeah, right? Uh. It took too long. I didn't know you knew for certain. Show something to me. I'm gonna cry. But for a second, you were gonna be like Kings or the XVI. <laughs> <laughs> cry me a uh. river. Oh, cry me a well, river. I don't know what we're supposed to do here, y'all. Well, I don't know, but you know, I had to make this interesting. I had to try. Anyway. Subtlety is not your forte. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So what will we do? Hmm. Maybe we should talk to some of the Zoras to find out. Maybe we should just talk to them. Well, no, we don't want to practice our Yeah, he skill. didn't die! <laughs> <laughs> Man, Navi, she's been waiting so long. She's been waiting patiently. Pain. Yeah, she's been Maybe waiting she's patiently. Puberty. That explains well, it. When, well, we need to get inside Lord Jabba Jabba, but I'm just not sure how. Zora's fountain is the source of the river. Lord Jabba Jabba lives in the fountain. We know this. Lord Jabba Jabba is the patron deity of the Zoras. Princess Rudo is in charge of preparing his meals, morning and night. Mm. Oh, <laughs> so she so she just suddenly decided to become his meal. I see. I see. That's what she did. Is what better thing to do to prepare somebody a meal than to be their meal, you know? That's not creepy or anything. <coughs> Zora's shop. We have fresh fish. Hmm. I fresh wonder. Fish. I wonder. What's inside of a wonder ball? Who knows what surprise it is? A wonder <laughs> ball can hide. Yummy Nestle chocolate. Can't chase it. Oh, yeah. Um, yes, we have seen Lord Jabba Jabba. Oh, this is interesting. According to the legend of Zora, the act of offering a fish to the Lord Jabu Jabu will make you happy. Really? Offering a fish to Lord Jabu Jabu? Ah, so that little person told us what we needed to know. How in the hell I still remember that song for that product? I don't know. I don't know either, because I still don't know what the heck you just The said. Wonder Ball. <laughs> <laughs> it was very popular in the mid... 90s. Mid to late 90s is when it was very popular. Then again, I still remember the Sock and Boppin theme song as well as the uh, Rat Trap theme song. Well, look at these fish Or Mouse here. Trap, not Rat Trap. Why don't I just catch one of them and see if Lord Jobby Jobby likes it? Let's see if he likes this fish here. We could go in the shop and see what they have because we hadn't been here. They said they had fresh fish. What do you guys say? As you see, the happy mask salesman behind the counter. I want to buy a fish, but they are a little too expensive. I have no choice but to catch one of the fishes that's swimming around on my food. Fish, not fishes, damn it. Stupid typos. Not like I did. I think fishes could be correct, nope, too, isn't nope. it? It's fishies. Get it right. <laughs> I gotta be a, a, a Zora, because I haven't been one yet. <clears throat> well, it looks like you too. Welcome. It has boobs just like you, Joseph. <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't have boobs, thank you very much. <laughs> oh I think you God. meant to say Liss. <laughs> um, I don't got much going uh, either, so. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my heavens, golly, wow. Okay, so a fish costs 200 rupees here, so yeah, very expensive. So even if we were. I thought it said geese nuts rupees, right there. <laughs> and the Sora tunic costs 300 rupees, so. Yeah, wow. Of course, obviously, we can't afford the Zora, Zora tunic yet. We can't even think about affording it. But at least we were... Link, he's he's quite the hunter. He's he's able to catch fish himself. Him is Lickit. Oh, yeah, Lickit. Right. Golly, I'm so sorry I got your name. Link is just a super name. That's right. That's right. He remembered. Probably because I just time marked that in one of the vi when that video came up. <laughs> so let's say about giving this fish to Lord Jabba Jabba. Then I wonder who this Princess Rudo is. Alicia. Hmm. Before we give that fish to Lord Jabba Jabba, I do want to explore here a little bit because uh, hold on just a second.
who's the one taking from you? I don't know, Felicia. Because I got them where they're all signed already. I don't know how to do it. I know it's possible, I just don't know how. It's not ever the, anything I've ever done. What is she wanting to do? Make it to where all of her passwords and stuff are blocked on her computer. Because she's because Patty's wanting to borrow it. I just like no. You know. <clears throat> does she? But anyway, does she have like an award document? No, if it wasn't the heck are you saying this time? Go, away, Navi. Drown! <laughs> okay, whoa, I don't whoa. Even Navi's not that hateful. Well, I don't know what Scott is. Evil dolls. <laughs> Did she now? As you already know! <laughs> Excuse and that well. earlier! But seriously, come on! <laughs> 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 um, so we actually have a skull tool there, but we cannot get it yet. So I wonder what that is in the uh, southeast corner of this area. Hmm. I wonder what it is. So why couldn't you get the skull tool because we don't have anything to reach it. It's so far away. We can't just go over and get it. You can't, like, shoot a nut at it or something? Nah, that wouldn't do it. Darn but it. we I can't get this skull to it. Yep, as handy dandy as nuts are, they, they won't do that. Yeah, the skull chill will stay wherever it landed at when he killed it. He doesn't have a means to get up there. He could kill the skull chill, but he wouldn't be able to get the gold skull chill or the token thing from it. Yeah, I could have killed it, but I just wouldn't be able to get it. Because it doesn't fall so. because gravity doesn't exist in this world unless you're jumping off a cliff. So, hmm, let's blow up this rock here. This looks suspicious. Oh, yes, I remember. <laughs> Hold on. Nothing! Hmm. I thought there was something here, but... We obviously can't grab that rock. We're not strong enough to get it. Let's put another bomb here. Okay, okay. I thought there was something there, but I was like, is this something you have to get later or what? Mm. Anyway, yeah, we can go in here. Oh <laughs> my, here we are. The moment we've all been waiting for. Oh, joy. Oh, yeah, joy, joy. We all love these, don't we? Everybody cover your eyes. <laughs> all kids, cover your eyes now. Pornographic content coming up. I'm just kidding. Yeah, go ahead and get your video flag. <laughs> <laughs> oh, golly. Oh, gosh. Oh, lady, what in the world? Oh, my. Oh, <laughs> oh look at that pose. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, heavens. Welcome, Wicked. I am the great fairy of magic and blowjobs! <laughs> oh god, whoa! Oh my heavens, these fairies are too much. I will give you a magic spell! Oh, please take <laughs> it, lick it, lick it good! <laughs> oh, she just blew a kiss at us. Oh golly. May you have your first wet dream! <laughs> oh my gosh. So what is this? You got Ferrore's Wind. This is a warp magic you can use with blue. Warp when you are in danger. You will teleport to the warp point. When you first use the magic, you will s create a warp point. When you use the magic, again, you can either dispel the warp point you created last time or warp to that point. Not really something I use much to be honest, but it can be handy. Remember, you can use Ferrari's wing only in dungeons that have a dungeon map inside. Look at that boob. And, okay. Yes, look at my boobs. <laughs> look at that shot. Game, what in the world are y'all trying to oh, tell us? Oh, this is for you. When battle has made you weary, please come back to see me for a blowjob. <laughs> <laughs> um, lady, I don't even know what that is. And, you know. You go I mean, learn today. I'm only like, how old? How old is Lickit or Lame? I mean, he he has to be like ten or. 11. And now I'm gonna go back down and masturbate and get wet thinking about you. 
Oh gosh. Oh, we gotta get out of here. I mean, I'm too young to understand what all that means, but I'm like, uh, I know that it means something bad. I mean, I, I, know it's, I just, I just know it's inappropriate. All right, but in, at any rate, well, let's see if uh, Lord Jabu Jabu, let's see uh, what he thinks about this fish we have in the next part. So we're just gonna stop and take a break here before we go into Lord Jabu Jabu because. Or if we do go in him, I don't know. I mean, because Princess Rudo's supposed to be inside him, but I don't know if we'll actually be able to get inside or not. Only one way to find out. Yeah, I'm pretty bad at this. <laughs> Thank y'all very much for watching. This has been Sky Hurricane and... Melissa Foxa. And... Joseph K. Thank y'all very much for watching, and hope you have a super awesome blessed day. And as always, my friends... Stay, stay awesome. awesome. Goodbye, y'all.